Okay, hello everyone. So welcome to another video from uh, Manlab and uh, Simulin Sore and uh, Simulisit. So today video we are going to discuss about the UAVs Tunbok uh, with the Matwork software. So uh, uh, so uh, the first one if you uh, if you are the new guys come to my channel. So uh, here is my, my Facebook address. Uh, so here you can see a lot, a lot of um, information. You can read to me on Facebook about the EVs, EV trees, electrical vehicle, and other resources I share for all of them in my Facebook and my uh, fan base as well. So you guys can uh, click and uh, inbox me or like the fan page to get more about the information here. And for the today video, we are going to uh, introduce and review uh, the UAV toolbox for the MATLAB uh, software. So if you uh, don't know, we, we can see the first uh, definition of the UAVs. So following the Wikipedia, the UAV would mean uh, stand for the the unmanned air vehicle UAV, commonly known as a drone or is an aircraft uh, without without any human pilot, crew or passenger on board. So and the UV is a component of an um, unmanned aircraft system, or uh, we can stand uh, short for the UAS, UAS, which includes adding your ground-based control and symptom communication with the UAV. And the fly of UAV may operate under remote control by human operator, which means we can't control and uh, uh, develop by the, the human human resource. Uh, at the remote uh, pilot aircraft or with the various degree of uh, autonomy such as autopilot assistant up to fully autonomous aircraft that had no provision for human intervention. So no need for human intervention on this uh, operation of UAV. So in the right side here you can see the uh, example from uh, Google. So we have the, uh, a lot of uh, example project here in the UAV for the maturity or the commercial purpose also. Okay, so come back uh, at the math work. So uh, from the 2021 uh, version, so math work uh, apply for the UAV toolbox. We mean design, simulate and deploy the UAV application. So here we can see the 3D uh, viewer and uh, we can apply the code also as well uh, to the um, to the real to, to the real uh, object. So let's see uh, what they say here. Uh, yeah, you can visit the matwork dot com such uh, products such UAV. So uh, UAV toolbox provide tool and reference application for the designing, uh, simulating, testing as well, and deploying the unmanned audio vehicle. And the drone application, so then you can design autonomous fly algorithm, the UAV mission, and fly air controller, and the fly lock analyze app. They, they give me the uh, the model give uh, give us an app as well, let you interactive or like the 3Ds, as I mentioned before, for the fly path, for the part part of UAV, the telemetry information, and the sensor reading from common flight lock format so you can uh, see here the video the for the definition of what is UAV to book and the, the next one is the desktop simulation and hardware in the loop testing of autonomous fly algorithm and a fly controller you can generate directly and split the UAV scenario so we can uh, simulate camera LIA IMU and GPS sensor as well output in the 3D environment or, the, or in the 2.5D uh, simulation environment. So you can uh, get start uh, with the four or five documentation. So uh, let's choose one here, the different application. So I will open one here. For example, the reference application. Okay, so it's right here below here. So, uh, reference application uh, as a basic for developing UAV application. Uh, 
The UV Toolbox will provide the reference example including the UV package delivery with obstacle avoidance. So here you can see the three package. So let's open one. The UV package delivery. Oh, they give directly to the math work uh, example. Okay, anyway, I open my lab here already. So, uh, so you can practice one package delivery, uh, follow step by step by using uh, here. So, of course, you need to install the UV toolbox uh, additioner. Yes, so they have eight uh, step, eight step. So you can see the in the left side, UV package delivery. Uh, in here we have eight step for the here example. First one you get in status. The second one you need to connect into ZCS. The three, the third, and next so you need to set in the QPI scenario and obstacle avoidance and uh, photorealistic simulation. And the final one you will need. So we need to follow step by step. And we have a 3D environment also. So it's very detailed and very interactive with the uh, 3D information. So let's come back here. We have let open the motion plan with the RT for the fixing, the fixed wing UAV. Yes, so it's always the same. So you need to follow. So for example, you can uh, I will demo for you. You open the uh, command window here and you copy and paste the code here. Or you just um, typing. For example, I will open the example here by copy and paste the command line uh, in the uh, command window. Let's zoom out a little bit and press enter. Okay, and then. And then the next one, you need to open the Simlink project file by uh, typing this one. Copy and I need to paste here. Okay, so the project initiate and I can open the Simlink model. Yes, here we go. Okay, so here is uh, one example, a similar model actually, the UV package delivery example. It's copyright from Mano from uh, 2020. So here we have the uh, multi-rotor aircraft. We mean we have uh, three subsystems. First one, internal sensor, a uh, lidar, the uh, mathematical uh, lidar and camera, and the other one is onboard computer, and the final one is the multi-rotor. Or model so you just click on example here they um, already uh, modeling first the on box or you can click here to see the, all the uh, sub symptom of the model or you can up to parent here Okay, external sensor here. Yes, okay. Okay, so they have here UAV animation here. Very, very interactive. Yes. And the last one is uh, Gallic Logic. They so developed the logical information here. The plan. Is the mask actually is the way you can see under mask. Yes, so always the the logic uh, the block and the math block.
glass in the third step in the yes, and they also provide for the model architecture and convention the explain for us very detail wiki the onboard computer the material rotor the ground control station and the internal sensor lidar and camera and the function of its uh, subsystem so for example the lidar and camera used to connect to a previous design scenario or the photorealistic simulation environment uh, these produce lidar and reading from environment as the aircraft flies and to it Yes, and the next one you need to click uh, getting started with shortcut. Yes, I will. Let's see here. So I need to come back here and click on the getting started here. So here you can see the A step, A step in total. So the first one is getting started and the final one is updating the high fidelity plan and here in top model, our model. So let's click on the getting started. And after that, we will see we set up for the four waypoint mission using the low fidelity material to plane model, run the UDV package, the V model, uh, which show the material to take off, fly, and land in the three plot. Yes, okay. So, next step, you will need to run the UDV package, the LV model. So, I will run it here. Click on the run button here. Yes, let's see what is going now. So my model is complying. Yes, yes, that's done complying. So it might be included the three models. So yes, yes. Here we go. So as uh, so maybe it's uh, take time a lot to the both the digital uh, symptom and uh, sub symptom also. So here is final result for us. So we have the path of UAV sub symptom here. The UAV animation here. And what they say here is the allow those it is a material to take off, uh, fly, and land in the 3D plot. Yes, okay. So here is our model the model uh, using UG path manager. So to uh, generate the path here, uh, they use the UV path manager block to uh, determine which the active waypoint uh, to the fly. And the right tip waypoint is part into the guided mode so selector state flow chart uh, to generate uh, the necessary inner uh, control command. So yes, so we just finished the uh, the first step. So we can follow a uh, step by step here, the step two to step eight, actually, uh, to learn more about the UAV. So I think for the today lesson, we will uh, uh, we we can uh, just stop by today and we can learn yourself uh, and we will and uh, for the next step we will discuss together further. Yes, all of this is three D model. So let's see. So now it is your turn to open the simulation and practice on the UAV subtitle. 
and I will see you in the next video. Thank you very much for the watching, and I hope to see you as the next video. Thank you.